This is Michael Smith of MedPage Today. In Science This Week, researchers report a method of finding and isolating antibodies that can neutralize a broad range of HIV strains. The work opens many doors, according to Dr. Barton Haynes, a vaccine expert at Duke University Medical Center in Durham, North Carolina, who was not part of the research team. Well, the study is exciting because it charts a path um, that these antibodies took in order to get to the point of being broadly neutralizing. And the hope is, is that vaccine developers will be able to develop vaccines that can drive uh, immune cells of, of many different people, not just rare people, uh, to make these kinds of antibodies. And so finding the actual B cells that make these and being able to study the antibodies that come out of them uh, is very exciting. The research has two potential ways to have an impact on the HIV AIDS pandemic, Haynes said. The study has potential for for two reasons. One is the antibody itself, since it is so broadly neutralizing, is under consideration for um, uh, being used uh, as a drug, if you will, in people to uh, knock down viruses and help control the virus in people either who have been exposed to prevent the virus from taking hold or or perhaps uh, from uh, those um, who are already infected. Uh, The problem with antibodies is that the virus tends to mutate away from antibodies and it may limit its therapeutic potential. But then from a preventive point of view, which is what we're talking about when we're talking about vaccines, again, it's finding the pathway that these antibodies took and then being able to go back in the pathway to, to go behind the antibody and, and follow the path that the antibody took is what vaccine developers hope will be um, a, a real help in learning how to design a vaccine that can induce a similar kind of pathway in a large number of people. I'm Michael Smith, MedPage Today.